I would like to make a few comments concerning the difference between the black revolution and the Negro revolution. There's a difference. When you study the historic nature of revolutions, the motive of a revolution, the objective of a revolution, and the result of a revolution, and the methods used in a revolution, you may change words. You may devise another program. You may change your goal and you may change your mind. Look at the American Revolution in 1776. That revolution was for what? For land. How was it? Why did they want land? Independence. How was it carried out? Bloodshed. Number one, it was based on land, the basis of independence. And the only way they could get it was bloodshed. The French Revolution, what was it based on? The land less against the landlord. What was it for? Land. How did they get it? Bloodshed. Was no love lost. Was no compromise. Was no negotiation. I'm telling you, you don't know what our revolution is. Because when you find out what it is, you'll get back in the alley. You'll get out of the way. The Russian Revolution. What was it based on? Land. The landless against the landlord. How did they bring it about? Bloodshed. You haven't got a revolution that doesn't involve bloodshed. And you're afraid to bleed. I said you're afraid to bleed. Long as the white man sent you to Korea, you bled. He sent you to Germany, you bled. He sent you to the South Pacific to fight the Japanese, you bled. You bleed for white people. But when it comes time to seeing your own churches being bombed and little black girls murdered, you haven't got no blood. So I cite these various revolutions, brothers and sisters, to show you, you don't have a peaceful revolution. You don't have a, a, a turn the other cheek revolution. There's no such thing as a nonviolent revolution. Only thing, only kind of revolution that's nonviolent is the Negro revolution. The only revolution based on loving your enemy is the Negro Revolution. The only revolution in which the goal is a desegregated lunch counter, a desegregated theater, a desegregated park, and a desegregated public toilet. You can sit down next to white folks on the toilet. <laughs> That's no revolution. <laughs> revolution is based on land. Land is the basis of all independence. Land is the basis of freedom, justice, and equality. The white man knows what a revolution is. How do you think he'll react to you when you learn what a real revolution is? You don't know what a revolution is. If you did, you wouldn't use that word. A revolution is bloody. Revolution is hostile. Revolution knows no compromise. Revolution overturns and destroys everything that gets in its way.